Max screaming Baldur's Gate Enterprise Edition with our Elven Archer Blitz to Hurton. Uh, seemed to have a bit of a network issue there before and lost lost the stream, so hopefully we'll be, we'll be alright now. We bought a Warhammer for Branwen. Drop that club because we can't sell it. And I should have picked up a helmet for her, but we'll fix that up later. Let's head back over to the carnival. Probably rest up before we leave, actually. Just make sure everyone's at full health with all their spells. weapon set. Beautiful. Said I was going to rest, didn't I? But that's alright. Okay, so that was where we just encountered that guy. We got these couple of tents here where people were selling some things. These couple of tents here, there are some encounters in these. I can't remember what they are, but Go in and have a look. Hello, pal. Good day. Consider yourself victimized by Vitari, Master Thief, and Pickpocket Extraordinaire. No time to chat. I don't think we can attack him before he gets away. Oh, maybe we can. There we go. That's what he gets for trying to attack to uh, pickpocket us. And we get some potions and a dagger and some gold. Well, we don't get all of our gold back though. He took a hundred gold from us, didn't he? Take your chance with Lady Timora. Yeah, I don't think I really want to play any of those games. Um, let's level up. No new skills. Level 2 spells, priestly spells, nothing new there, and basking chance, flame burn, hold person, hold person, that's what we want. Don't need spirit ultra hammer, she's already got it. You know what, I'm gonna go all hold person. Wow, I don't remember getting three, that's amazing. That will do. Actually, let's. We can't camp in here. What a we nuisance. follow the righteous path, the path of hell. Hey, 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 hey! Why? Right. The whole party, please. Much better. Same, head in here. Gamesman. I don't think there's really much in here. Is there? Commoner, gamesman, gamesman. Yeah, it's not worth playing any of these games, so we'll head out. Okay. This is where you start to earn your keep. Why did it do that after the first spear? Right. Let's go in here. 
area. Pretty stand, pretty standard uh, merchant here. Let's see what you have to offer. Oh, that's right. This was the guy we checked before, who didn't have any. Who didn't have any resurrection stuff, so he wasn't much use to us. I just don't use potions enough to ever really worry. Still haven't decided on a robe. Uh, armor class plus one versus slashing, save versus death. Electrical resistance, 20%. Yeah, that's the better option to begin with. It at least gives some protection. Uh, could we sell that to him or not? No, we can't. Fine, let's head over to this one. I've got the best prices this side. See what you have to offer. Uh, weapons, weapons. Just a few weapons. That's all. And you'll give me 150 for that. That is fine. Um, this one here. What have you got? Composite longbow, longbow, shortbow, throwing daggers, darts, slings, heavy crossbow, light crossbow, arrow of piercing plus one. Hmm, you know what? I might just buy as many of those as I can. I can't buy many, but let's get them all. They could be of use. Long sword. I wanted to give someone now you've got bastard swords I should have kept some of those I wanted to give some spare weapons to these guys just in case because up until you clear the first mine or clear the mines um, there is sort of like a random chance that your uh, your weapons, any metal weapons, are going to break in combat. Oh, that's right, and I wanted another longsword for me. So it might be worthwhile buying a second weapon for each of these guys. Or I could just wait until I pick up some more weapons and remember to keep them. Oh boy, I've got to remember to do something now. That's not going to be easy. Let's see. Just come over this way a little bit. That'll do. I'll come back there in a minute. Let's do these other tents up this way. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. Really? Let's see. Chainmail, splint, sutted leather, and large shields, and that's it. Really? You don't really have all that much to offer. And we got that crate there. Let's pick the lock. Didn't really mean to rest there, but anyway, misclick and all. Six gold, not to be sneezed at. And you can't go into any of these tents, but there's another tent over here that you can go into. But we're gonna go around here first and just uncover this little bit, last little bit of the map. Southwest, cor southeast corner, as it were.
let's rest. Been to pretty well everything in the carnival here. We'll need to clear that area out a little bit, but it's time to clear out the rest of this. There is a bit of a hard encounter up here, so I'm just going to save the carnival. Where is up there? It is, and let's hope. Sorry, MR6. I didn't uh, MRA6. I didn't see you there, or is that Mr. A6? Uh, what character am I? I am playing an elven archer. So archer, because this is the uh, enhanced edition, archer is a subclass of ranger that specializes in longbow, shortbow, etc. So I can eventually get all five levels of longbow, um, and I get a bonus after level four, I get a bonus skill called called shot, which allows me to, for five rounds or something like that, do extra damage. Might only be might be less than five rounds, I can't remember. But. So that's what I'm playing. Um, and I'm playing basically everyone has a missile weapon because that's the way I like to Yeah. That's the way I like to um, to handle my encounters from a distance if possible thanks to the way Baldur's Gate works with this fog of war and the whole auto-pausing thing. Except in cases like this, you can generally uh, just uncover one or two opponents at a time and be pretty safe uh, and just all attack with um, missile weapons and not do too badly. So we are going to... Normally I concentrate everyone shoots at the same person, but at the moment I'm concerned about the fact that um, Dino Hair here is right out in front, so... Okay, I really shouldn't have been too concerned. I thought all of these guys had bows, but it looks like they don't. So, let's just concentrate fire, and there we are. And that's nice and easy. Yeah, in this case I didn't have to worry about Dino here. No, Don that's only 12 HP, and she's on second level. Or is it third? Yeah, she's not too bad, but, um, you know, very low armor class, because she's a mage, so I do like to be a little bit careful. It's, uh, I keep forgetting it's not until a little bit later that all of the kobolds start wielding bows. They're usually kobold commandos, though. Ah, uh, yeah, she has high constitution. Yes, you're right, she does. Oh, and let's spread the love around. Protection scroll can go to you. Actually, you can be carrying that book, too. It makes it a little bit easier. Okay, and let's wait a sec for everyone to get back in sync, so that... There we go, good. Okay. So... That went well with kobolds. Actually, I think I was thinking of a different uh, map when I thought there was a uh, encounter over here. 
I think I was thinking of the church east of Beragost, if I remember right. Okay. Coins here and there, that'll all go well. Uh, do we have anything to put in the bag? Just that. Will that go in the box? No, that's a pain in the butt. Protection from evil. Oh, let's write that. There we go. This is before the Nashkel mines. I'm going to do a clean out of a lot of the area around the mines first before I go down in there. Just give me a chance to get my levels up a little bit higher on some of the characters. Um, I'm not the sort of impatient speed runner. I mean, I did I did go very quickly to get um, Dinah hair from the Knolls, but I haven't finished cleaning out that area um, because. Instead, I um, I wanted to get her in the party as quickly as possible. Okay. We follow the righteous path, the path of hell. Thanks for that, Ajuntus. That's that's great. Just quick save. Yeah, I know I have plenty of levels for the mines, but yeah, I just like to clean the area out a bit around it first. XP, that's what it's there for. Hmm, I had a feeling there was a big bear or something around here somewhere, but maybe I'm wrong. No caves or anything there. Yeah, the Archer class is pretty powerful, but um, the biggest problem is the, the lack of armor. If something does get in close, uh, and I get the feeling from some things that I've read online that maybe there might have been one version of um, the Enterprise edition of Baldur's Gate when this class was introduced. That may have still allowed the ranger, the um, archer, to wear the anchor armor, but you can't anymore. <laughs> this version that I've got definitely does not allow it, and so uh, it's really just uh, studded leather is the best I can get. Find the best best suit of enchanted studded studded leather you can get, and that's going to be it. Any other sort of, you know, protection items that can boost your AC a little bit more, you just take what you can get at this stage. But that's alright. I briefly considered starting again as just a plain fighter, specialising in longbow, but you get a few extra bonuses as the archer, and eventually because I'm still a ranger subtype, I will be able to cast druid spells. Um, so you know that that'll offset things a little bit. It won't, you know, give me all the protection that I want, but it'll help a little bit. It'll uh, and then to cast some heals or some other simple, simple spells anyway. So. Almost got it all cleaned out and can go on to the next bit. 
How did I miss that bit up there? That is so disappointing. And you know what? I'm going to leave it. There you go. You can't say I've got OCD anymore because I'm not going to go and get that spot. Um, let's go and do this one. Actually, no, what am I talking about? I've got stuff to sell. Let's sell up. Yeah, because you get the Archer class does get a better um, Thaco to hit Armor Class Zero um, because you get a bonus to hit even above the weapon specializations. You get other bonuses. Why don't I go in there? That's the wrong wrong uh, tent. You get other bonuses every few levels. So uh, even if you were a straight fighter, you'd uh, the Archer would still essentially be better at the same level. At least once you get up to some higher levels. I don't get any of those bonuses just yet. Uh, let's... Oh, you're not going to... Oh, five gold a short sword. I suppose that's not too bad. Did I see that right? I was getting five gold a short sword from there and only two... Hang on. Is that really right? Or did I read it wrong? No, I was reading it wrong. Why don't I think those twos look like fives? It hasn't even been all that long a day. Okay. The one gift lost. Not usable. Wizard Slayer, of course. Missile Blast, 66. So it's a necklace of fireballs or necklace of missiles. No, thank you. And the protector, yeah. Shield amulet, no. Yeah, no, we're doing good. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure the archer class, uh, every few levels, every four or five levels or something, gets another plus one to hit above and beyond because the archers being a subclass of ranger, which is sort of considered a subclass of fighter, have the same progression in to hit armor class zero as a fighter does. But as they progress through levels, the archer gets um, extra plus ones. Um, it's sort of... Did I sell everything I needed to? Yes, I did. Uh, it's sort of like how the Kensai gets um, extra plus ones to hit and damage as he goes up in levels as well, uh, beyond the normal that he gets as a fighter subclass anyway. Uh, so yeah, in the end, the archer will, an archer specialising in a bow will out hit a fighter specialising in a bow. Uh, Okay, let's do a little bit of movement here first. You're going to try and paralyze him. You, bow, you, bow, you, bow, you, bow. And now that you're back there, magic missiles. Okay. One down. Really should let these guys do whatever they want. They'll pick up targets anyway, but... but concentrating fire. Why? Why are you running away, Agentus? because you've got the thing where you're supposed to be as far away as possible, so that's why you're doing that. And he's down. Okay. Uh, 
I don't think these halberds bring much. But... Oh, yeah, you're picking up those. Cool. Uh, this wandering monster encounter thing, I always come up here a little bit gingerly because occasionally you'll have an encounter, you'll fight a few things here and there'll be some other creature like a, a winter wolf or something waiting up here for you or a bear or something. It doesn't happen very often but it's happened to me once or twice and you think you're home and hosed and you're leaving to go and wrap up that little thing and get back on the road and you get clobbered by something. Okay. Damn it. If I'm going to rest now, it's going to be almost dark by the time I finish resting. But I've got to rest, so let's get that out of the way. Okay, eight hours rest, all looking good. Let's save. I call this Knoll Stronghold, even though we're not actually at the Knoll Stronghold, but we're heading there, so... Just a sec... Yeah, well, good... And that. Sorry. Okay. Now it's Smurf Central. I am definitely not going to pick up every weapon I find here. Because these guys... Let's just go over here and clean out... Uh, uncover all of this along here first. But when I go up that canyon back up here... I come up here... It's going to be Smurf Central. Exvarts, whatever they're called. And I'm going to kill so many of them that... Frankly, I am not going to be able to carry everything. Oh, got to be careful. I think there's a bear or something down this canyon, down this little bit here. Let's have a look. We want to come over here to uncover this as much as possible. Come up this way. No, I was wrong. I did have an encounter when I first came through here with a couple of wolves in this area and killed them, so that must be the only thing. I know there's another bear up here, but that's the big old bear that the Exvarts sort of have charmed. Oh, look, another wolf. And you're just a normal wolf, so you're not really too much to worry about because they're going to kill you pretty quickly, although the wolves do run up very quick. Uh, let's just have you cast Magic Missile. And there we go. And once again, Blitz has taken out... Yeah, this is the Exvart camp here. The Knoll Fort is, is further along to the west. Um, let's just have a look at some stats here. Percentage of kills in the party. 64% of the kills. And I've done 99 kills. I almost got to 100. One more kill. Okay. No more wolves. Yeah, we're going up to do the Exvart camp. And then... Well, if we go west from here, we go to the... Um, there's a river there, and there's a Mogus. There's a couple of bridges... And there's some ogres, and that big bear, which we've avoided so far. Um, we'll clean all that one out too, and then maybe tonight, maybe not, maybe tomorrow, we'll do the the uh, Knoll Fortress. Actually, we've already killed all the Knolls at the Knoll Fortress when we went and got uh, Dinah here. Uh, there'll be some Knolls around the north part of the map, and then there'll be the Exvarts around the bottom. Um, this area is just going to be so easy. Uh, these guys really are not much of a challenge, but there's just so many of them. There we go. 
go. And my inventory is full already. Swords everywhere. Let's keep my arrows all full up. Okay. And you can sell that later on. And we're good. Who's next to get a level? A little while for Blitz, a bit longer for Minsk, way longer for Agentis, and Branwen. Uh, everyone's not too long. Okay, Blitz is going to be the next one to get a level. It'll still be a while yet, but... Okay. Just so many of these little buggers. Again, just pausing here to let the game reset so that we're at the start of a round if we uncover any more. So now when I click on these guys we should all be able to shoot straight away. If I had have just charged forward after the end of that last guy, half of these guys might have been still in the same round and not able to actually attack straight away. So you notice there's a pause now between most of these guys attacking. It's because they can only do one attack per round. They've done that and they're um, waiting until their next time that they can attack. Uh, Emma, when you're getting out in front there, that's not good. There we go. I said I wasn't going to pick up all these short swords, didn't I? Oops, that was the wrong person. I should not have given that to you. That should have gone to Emma. Oh, you've got terrible strength, Emma. Can't carry anything. Even Dinahe has better strength than you. Okay. Where are we? Still more of them. That one next. And then that one. And so far we haven't even been hit. We're doing well. Let's just rest for a sec. Spread the loot around. Whoops. Fact is, I'm really not carrying all that much because these arrows, I don't think, actually weigh anything, do they? No. Hmm, one of the wonderful, bizarre things about most of these games where 80 arrows weigh nothing. i tell you what, having actually been an archer I can tell you 80 arrows they do weigh a lot and I'm even talking modern carbon fiber arrows I think the the one that I remember that's the funniest is um Neverwinter Nights, uh, it's probably the same here, but Neverwinter Nights you can get a stack of 50 throwing axes that you can use, and they weigh nothing. It's like, a single throwing axe is, you know, got to be a kilo, at least. And so you're saying you can just carry 50 of them and they weigh nothing. It's like, nah, sorry, that don't make sense. Nexlet, the Exvart. You monster, you kill us when we do nothing to you. Well, Ursa kill you. Ursa protect us because Ursa kind. Um, we kill you because you've just 
we've walked in here and you've just started to try and kill us okay everybody full whatever we can at Ursa because she is a big bear and if we're not careful she is going to annihilate us okay looks like everyone's Wow, that was lucky, not a single hit from the bear, because those bears hit hard. And that chief took a bit to take down, but not too bad. And another lone expert. Another dead expert. Pause to let the game catch up to the rounds and again yeah see a little bit of a pause there I had it hadn't finished that that current round wait a few seconds when we're fine and then we move forward and no even then we're still still not getting much luck there getting the um, getting the guys to all be able to attack immediately very disappointed in how much I get for those swords. I know it. More of them. And we're done. I really wish sometimes it would actually tell you how many of those other arrows would have hit. Basically, it's what, four arrows and two sling bullets all being launched at him at the same time? He had no chance. And that's the whole idea. That's why it's such an effective tactic. Particularly against these low levels. As things get a little bit harder, I'm probably going to do things like let Dino here have the Grease spell, because that can severely slow down opponents that are moving towards us. Um, which doesn't help you too much if you know, you're facing another spellcaster, but it is useful against some monsters. So, why? Look here. I find a bunch of adventurers I don't think I've ever seen. Hmm. Though from the looks of it, you don't seem to be that well equipped. Well, you're in a lot of luck. I can solve all your problems. I have a huge collection of potions and scrolls, all for a cheap price. Right now, I can give you a potion of extra healing for 25 gold, a scroll of protection for petrification for 25 gold, and a scroll of protection of magic for 100 gold. What do you say? I've got a feeling that these are some of these are bad, so I'm not going to buy any of them. Sorry, but we're not needing to stock up right now. You don't know what you're missing. Yeah, well... That's alright, I, I just... They, they say never look, lift a, never look a gift horse in the mouth, but... You know, some unknown random guy wandering the wilds out in the middle of nowhere comes up to you and offers you... You know, some fairly significant magical items. Potions of healing and and uh, scrolls of magical protection from petrification and magic and it's like really? you're giving it to me for that little money? they've got to be fake so I covered that yeah I knew I know one of them is probably real I can just never remember and I'm I'm not at the stage yet where I'm looking at, at guides while I'm playing. I will later on because there are a few... Um, that's a dire wolf. And you're right out in front, Dino here. That's not good. Yeah, uh, as the game progresses, I will start looking a little bit at some um, guides to help me 
but generally speaking uh, I'm not at the moment so yeah I, I know I could have worked out which of those was good and which one wasn't but uh, for now it's one down for now I'm just going to uh, leave that guy yeah you're right Branwen come on guys take this guy out there we go well done yeah heal or heal thyself okay What's up here? Can't remember. I know there's the cave above the Exvart camp. I'm going to get back to that in a minute. There's no cave here. I th think there's another. Oh no, that was the only guy that was hanging around here. The one with the scrolls and stuff. So let's come and do the top part of the camp. Going to join us in one or not? Actually, you are going to go and scout for us, is what you're going to do. Oh, look. Okay, everybody. Smurf time. There we go. Inventory full again. You must be close to full. Mm, a few more. No. Four. Okay, you're full. And you're full. Okay. You really can't carry any more of those either, so... Get you to carry. Oops. just going. Let's all come around the fire here. Now thankfully this game doesn't actually... Whoa! That fire isn't real from a Hertie's point of view so it's actually not a problem for me to stand over the top of it. Take him out. There's only two of them. There was only two of them. Yeah, I know. I tell myself not to not to pick up all of these swords and stuff because they're really just an absolute waste, but I end up doing it anyway in the long run. Um, it, part of it's because I keep forgetting how little they're actually worth. Uh, I need to do myself up a cheat sheet one day that says, you know, you only sell leather armor for one gold and short swords for two gold, so don't bother picking them up. Uh, but you also can look at it and go, well, you know, I'm clearing out this whole area anyway, and... If I'm just going to go back to town and sell up, you know, it's, it's all extra gold, so I guess that's uh, not too bad. Okay, I think, is this the bear cave? Yes, this is the bear cave. Okay. The bear is attacking Minsk. Really? Well, that's good. So then maybe what we'll do, if the bear's attacking you, Minsk, we're going to let you attack the bear. And that will... You're going to be the tank. 
for the rest of these guys. Yeah, you've only just... Ah! Gee, you'd think you could tank just one more hit from the bear. Minsk. Minsk. His mighty berserker wrath will not go unremembered. Yeah, don't worry, we're going to go and... Tis something most unnatural here and I want no part of it. Yeah, thanks, Imwin. Yeah, we're going to... Oh, man, all of those uh, swords that he was carrying are now on the ground. Uh, let's see... Uh, hang on, why am I doing it that way? Open that up. Put that over there, put that over there and take those. And then we come over here. And we drop that, that, and that, and we take that, 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 hmm, gonna have to do a little bit of management here, you are going to drop some of these, these for me. Not yet. Okay. I guess we can head back to town, although I've got enough space to take those. I know I can't get much for them, but So little left to uncover. Can we go on without Minsk? Yes, I guess we can. Resurrecting Minsk. I hate when it brings me back over there. your party before venturing forth. Where's the other one? There we are. You went the other way! Okay. It's interesting. Oh, 
this one. Raised it. There we go. And let's identify that and that. Let's do them one at a time so we actually see what they are. Braces of armor class 8. Right, and flail plus 1. None of us use it, so we're not going to bother with that. Um, that can go to mince. It's going to be sold. Uh, and no. Does this help me at all? No. Uh, anyone else? Is it going to help any of us? No. Whoops. No, that's what I meant to do. Uh, and your inventory is full. Well, we're just going to have to sell that because really it's not much use. Okay, Minsk. Give you all of your stuff back. That. You're going to come and heal him. Yeah, let's, let's not. Let's just... Yeah, you're going to heal up when I go in there to sell anyway, I guess. Unless you run out of heals for the day, which you probably have. Flail, halberd, braces, you don't have anything. Yeah, even those halberds were only two gold. Shield plus one, no, none of us are using large shields. And we sold those already. Cool, okay. Let's go and rest in the inn. Noble rent, and we're done. Of course we have. Okay, I don't see any enemies. That means we're in probably for a bad time. Because if there's no enemies to begin with, there's only usually two things I've ever seen here. One is... well, probably three. Occasionally there'll be a wolf of some sort, whether it's a normal wolf, a dire wolf, vampire wolf, something like that. Or a bear of some type up here. Or... It's an Ogre Magi, which is going to be a tough fight. So let's get into position and let's just creep forward the bear. Okay. 
cave bear. So just a little bit worse than normal. So you are going to pump magic missiles into him while the rest of us pump normal missiles into him. And so far we have been incredibly lucky that not to get hit even once. Okay. A few more levels on my... a couple more levels even on my characters and that would not have been much of a fight at all, but considering that most of my characters are only second level at this point... level 2, level 2, level 3, level 3, level 3, level 2... okay, half and half. Level 2.5 on average. Um, Cave bears are pretty hard early on, but as I said, archers, pretty good combination. Travel to there, one day and two hours to get to there. Okay, I'm going to save that. old stronghold, but that's where we're going. Let's rest. And because I don't really want to be doing everything in the night, let's rest again. Wow. We didn't have a single encounter while we rested. That is amazing. So I'm going to save again. Just to be sure. Um... Uh, yeah, why not? We'll come down and do this bear first. Another cave bear. He's going to be fun. I think we get some boots out of this, if I remember rightly. Where's he gone? Oh, there he is. There's Jared. Okay. I think what I'm going to try is have Imo and Sneak. We follow the righteous oh. path. Hide in shadows failed. Succeeded. There we go. Sneak over here. Oh, leaving shadows. Hide in shadows. Oh, failed. Come on. It's not far to go for this bear. He's so close. Okay, obviously there's not enough shadows around there. There's the bear. Put one arrow in him. And let's go. Where is he? There we go. Come on, you stupid bear. Hmm. Hang on, is he still coming? Probably could have just put the whole team on the bridge and kited him across the bridge. Because he's running again. Where in the name of... Where'd the bear go? Okay. We got a bear to find. Has he gone all the way up this way? There he is. Not again, Minsk. Come on. Do what we can here. Okay. 
There we go. And let's see now, we all back to using the right weapons. Good. Go back and get our award. Why, well, thank you. That old lumbering oaf could have had me there if it weren't for you, young lumbering oafs like yourselves here, if you're going to be wandering around these mountains for a while. You may need a better pair of boots. As for me, you couldn't pay me to stick around in this place. And off he goes. So we gained these boots, which, once again, we cannot identify. So we are going to have to... I really have to get Dinah here a identify spell. So we can at least rest up and do that. So before I go and do the other side of the river, we're going to go north up here and go to the other bridge and clean out the orcs and the ogres and whatever else it is that's up there, I don't recall. Just as soon as we clean up these gibberlings. Oh, just the two of them. Okay. Ooh, wild dog. Okay, any more? Yeah, on there. And one there. Two, three there. You can come out of the way there, Dinah here. And then you can heal her. There we go. Well done. Kawik save. Got to be really careful in this area because there's a whole bunch of hobgoblins, I think. And some ogres on the bridge. See, and these hobgoblins have bows, so they are going to get at least one shot back most of the time. That's why, wait a bit. Be sure that we're ready to move forward, move forward. Uh, that and that will take. Hmm. A lone scout, was it? Oh, hello, Mr. Bear. Gonna leave you alone if you leave us alone. That sound fair? some in it somewhere. Okay, so this guy has another bunch of bandits or something that appear over here, I think. Ah, oh, weary travel. Well met. Neville the fairest of all fair bandits at your service. What may I do for you this hour? Well, for starters, you could tell you men in the bushes to drop their bows and step out in the open. Perhaps you could es escort us through your territory and ensure that we meet no harm along the way. You can give us all your money and 
then let us kill you one by one. Now I'm going to do the... Well, for starters, you can tell your men in the bushes to drop their bows and step out into the open. Did you find all five of them? Pity. I shall have to train them better. Anyhow, I'm afraid that I can't abide your wishes. My men would think me a coward to surrender in the face of such a paltry force. Truly, I see no other choice than to order them to fire at will and rob your sad corses, corpses of any iron they may carry. Come, men, I believe the choice is clear to us. Okie dokie. See, you're just brave or stupid, I don't know, but you are literally there by yourself. And we are going to cut you down, and then we're going to go over there and attack your friends. So, you know, like, seriously. Okay. Why did I get you to pick that up? I really need to identify that so I can use it. Put those over there. Ooh, getting very low on arrows now. Let's... Pass this around. And we've got... You're going to need some more bolts, or some more bullets soon, or stones, whatever you want to call them. Uh, like that magic. And you haven't identified that. Didn't actually try to get you to identify this. And that's okay. Quick save. Sorry, quick save. There we go. There they are. God, they're such terrible shots. Okay, we need these arrows, because we're starting to run low. Let's pick up all the gems. Chainmail. No, I should have picked up that helmet. Okay, you can carry chain. And drop that. Gems for you. Swords for you. That is a spare sword for you. There we go. And we're doing good for arrows. And that, that and that, that and that, and that, and that, and that. Ooh! How did you sneak up on me like that? Right. Now we got them all. Hopefully. Concerned this storm is going to zap one of us. That is not fun when you get struck by lightning in this game. And I will jump, I know it, because I've done it several times before. Let's see if we can sleep through this storm. Yep, that worked pretty well. Berserker.
magic missile him please and you can do hold on him again you just aren't having any luck Minsk I need aid soon lest my hamster become an orphan and we got a level yay Okay, that's a spare sword for you, Minsk. But you'll go back to using bows for now. Let's do this level up. Yay, one more proficiency slot. We know exactly where that's going. A longbow. So now that gives us an extra plus two to hit because it was plus one previously an extra plus one to damage and an extra half an attack per round so we should get two attacks per round now because we had an extra half a attack per round previously that is great attacks per round now oh, because we we get some bonuses because we're an archer as well five attacks every two rounds so three attacks one round to the other. That will be great. Um, how are our stats doing? 126 kills. Nearly 60% of the kills in the party. Okay. Uh, we really do want Minsk healed as much as possible. So we'll do that. What do we just... Ah, uh, Hobgoblin. Go. Oh, Minsk gets hit again. Seriously, Minsk. You got the best da damn armor of anyone. Well, apart from Agentus. You got full plate armor, and you're still getting hit with arrows. finish off on that bridge let's just clear this bit over here and I wanted to go where was that other one we killed just before I had a feeling there was another suit of chain mail somewhere around here that we didn't pick up I thought it was this guy who had chain mail I guess we did pick it up after all it wasn't chain mail over there Okay, well, let's head onto the bridge. Ooh, notification. 
part time, full time, overtime, 11 minutes ago because I have streamed for 25 hours. Wow, really? That's that's scary. It's in less than a week. Okay. The other ogre. People, are we going to be able to? And he's dead. Down. All good. All good. So that's the main encounters here. I think there's a couple of other things across the other side of the bridge, but most of it was these ogres on the bridges that was the hard part. Ah, uh, no, I wanted to do that. Hmm. Is this the one with the gibbling attack? Yes, it is! Okay. We're going to get attacked by gibblings in a sec. When we talk to this one, I think she's a ranger, maybe. Or yes, friend. Ah, I see a party of adventurers that seek to do good in the world. How would you like to fend off a herd of gibblings? Yes, we would gladly join you for a while. I mean, seriously, no, I wouldn't like to in real life for fend off a horde of gibblings. But uh, fire magic works well against the gibblings, so if you have such spells, use them. Where are they? There they are. Let's just let the guys do whatever they want. Actually, you should probably cast armor on yourself. and talks to you. Gibberlings are a plague that must be wiped from the Sword Coast. Perhaps we will meet again. Yeah, I don't think so. But, you know, it's nice to think that you think we might. There's also another ogre or something around a fire down here, is there? Or is that a different map I'm thinking of? So many of these maps blur it. Ah, yep, there he is. And you can sort of talk to this guy. So let's... I just can't remember what the deal is with him. I think we end up having to kill him anyway. So let's just see, shall we? Let's have I will crush Okay, you know bother me now, me eat. We fight after me fat happy. Uh, me fight now, make you dessert. Pound you to pudding. Mmm, pudding. Right, so, Minsk. Do you think just this once you might be able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with someone like that and not just immediately get crushed. I mean, I'll be standing over here putting multiple arrows into this guy. Actually, 
let's let's use those piercing arrows just to see if we can make this happen any quicker okay I think we're ready oh I didn't actually tell you to attack did I? oh yes maybe I did okay that was fairly quickly that we took him down who uh someone leveled oh Minsk leveled Oh, damn storm, I told you. Um, who killed the ogre? Minsk. 16 slashing damage. Way to go, Minsk. Oh, damn it. These storms. So what we're going to do is we're going to select Minsk. We're going to level him up and then we're going to sleep straight away, which will, I mean... In reality, we would all die in the storm. Uh, but we're going to sleep straight away so that we can... Yeah, that looks good. So that we can all heal up and hopefully the storm will be over. We'll have passed once we're done. You may not rest at this time, really. Why not? Thank you. Yeah, that all looks pretty good now. Quick save. Let's head over this way. Mm, that's right. Was it here? No. I sort of had a feeling there was some, maybe some hidden loot around here somewhere, but there isn't. Hello, Mr. Squirrel. Whoop, 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 Mr. Bear. Whew. Dodged a bullet there. Or oh, dodged an angry bear, I guess, is probably more accurate. Um, it's a strange mechanic those bears have. I'll show you now. He'll just be sitting there, calm as can be, and then... He'll decide to turn and attack. Let's see, can we walk down here without him wanting to attack any of us? We really need to get Dinah here as far away from him as possible. That worked this time. Absolute miracle. Mm, what have we seen? An Ogrillion. I think this was the only game I've ever seen a creature called an Ogrillion. I think it's some sort of ogre hybrid, but sort of like half ogre, half man. But really don't know what it is. Don't remember seeing it in any monster manuals or what have you. And what this game really needed, which it didn't have. Oh, there is that help page, but that really just shows you what all those do. Uh, that's the quick save. That's the options. Uh, the record. That's the journal. But the journal doesn't really... It would be great if the journal had, like, a monster compendium in there so that you could find information about all of these creatures that you are killing. Because not everyone knows about them. As I said, I don't know what an Ogrillion is. I need to look it up. And we are so close to being done. Let's go along this way and come back. That middle bit. 
Ooh. Another Agrillion. Make that two. Ooh, he was... Look at that. Two quick arrows from me. And a third from Emuin after Ajantus. Very, very quick. Okay. Good on you if you save the day. And oh, sorry, pumping the mic. Another ogre. Hmm. And we're right out in the middle of it. Not that it really mattered. per usual we'll head into town and sell up before we move on to the next little area I think we will sell up and then probably call it a night uh, let me just check the world map there's nothing to the west of us here I don't believe and I can't recall if there's anything north. But let's just really quickly check that out because I just like to make sure that whenever I... Yeah, we can go south, we can't go west. We can go north, so we need to come up here somewhere. Probably just up here and try and go north and just uncover what's up there. We're not actually going to go that way, but uh, I just like to uncover those extra portions of the map so I know where I can go and where I can't. Do, 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 do. And let's just see how long we've got for various people to level up. You will be next, Emowyn. As I said in the previous uh, stream, how strange it is to be playing Baldur's Gate again. I've been playing Neverwinter Nights 1 and 2 for a while now, and in both of those, um, you... All characters, all characters level up at exactly the same point in time. Uh, they all use the same XP to level up, so it is really strange to have just one character leveling up at a time in Neverwinter Nights. They all do at exactly the same time because they all have the same requirement. Winter Wolf. Okay, this is going to be fun because he shoots a cone of cold or whatever it is at us. So we're going to need to take him out quickly. Yeah, that was pretty good. Let's just... Whoa, 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 that's not what we want. Stop right there. Let's just double check and make sure there's no others. We can sell that pelt in Nashville. Okay. I'm tired. Too. Yes, I know. I'm tired of you complaining too. That didn't sound like Branwen. That sounded like 
Um, Dinah hair. Maybe we will sleep first, just to overcome the fatigue. Not that it's a problem, really. No. Damn it, sometimes that thing is in the way. There we go. So he's going to give us, I don't know, a couple of hundred gold or whatever it is for that pelt. Five hundred. Whoa. Uh, we want you to identify that longsword, which is just a longsword plus one. But considering it's the first real magic, decent magic weapon, apart from all of those, oh, the, that... I should say. Plus one dagger that we got. Identify those boots. Frost's embrace. Cold resistance plus 50%. So, until we find something more appropriate, that is, of course, going to go on my primary character. And then, that's going to be our weapon layout now. I forgot I was using those arrows. Oh well. Um, let's put these down here. Just gonna sell them in a second anyway, but that's fine. Okay. Let's get rid of these and that and that. Sell. Let's get rid of all of these. Oops. Morning Star. Don't do that one yet, because I'm not sure if we've got that yet. On Diner here. Oops. And that. So, there we go. There we go. So. And then sell, and then sell, and then sell. And then sell. Was there anything in here? Nope. Clues done, done. Make sure we're doing good with all of this. Yep. Need to get you more sling bullets. And you need a couple of stacks of arrows. And can you learn that spell? Yes, you can. Infravision. We should sell that one. Let's just put that in there. And we probably need more bullets here too, don't we? Okay, so let's get a full stack of 12 for them. And we're good for everything else. Thy decency is refreshing. So many we meet are lacking. Did I not buy that then, or did someone else buy it? I didn't buy that then. Damn it. This interface is a bit clunky at times. Where was it? There. One. Now I'll buy 11 more because I did it wrong. Done. Buy. Done. Good. And then two lots for you. One, two, you still don't have a helmet. 
Man, I just left half a dozen helmets on the on the field, as it were. very much for watching this stream. I'm going to leave it here now. Let me just save in Nashcal. And uh, we will continue this tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.